32 states have considered and banned same-sex marriage. What's unique about this year's ballot measures regarding same-sex marriage, and what are the polling trends? I think this is going to be a really exciting year for that issue. I think that things are going to be different. Um, I, one thing that's different this year is in Maine. Voters are being asked in Maine to legalize same-sex marriage, and no state's voters have ever been asked that. So far, they've always been asked to prohibit same-sex marriage. Uh, the polling numbers in Maine indicate that that measure has a very good chance of passing. Um, in Maryland and Wisconsin, the state legislatures legalized same-sex marriage over this past biennium, and there are popular referenda from opponents on the ballot this year to block those measures. Again, polling in both of those states indicates that voters are likely to support same-sex marriage on the ballot. And then Minnesota voters this year have sort of a, the same kind of question that the other 230 states have seen before. Shall we define marriage as between one man and one woman? Uh, that one is in a statistical tie in the latest poll that I saw. And interestingly, there are two other data points that um, lead me to think that at least one of these measures is likely to pass this year. So the Pew Forum on Religion and Public Life has polled Americans on their attitude towards same-sex marriage for the last decade at least. And over the last 10 years, voter attitudes have done a 180. Uh, it used to be a plurality of Americans opposed same-sex marriage, and more recently this year, uh, their poll indicated that a plurality of Americans support same-sex marriage. And NCSL data on voter behavior on those same-sex marriage bans that 32 states have considered over the years indicates a similar change. The uh, support for banning same-sex marriage has declined steadily since 2005. So I very rarely go out on a limb and predict that any particular measure is going to pass or fail, but I'm going to say that I think at least one of these same-sex marriage questions is going to get a nod from the voters this year for the first time.